Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I look like a businessman. I look like a man right now, like a businessman, like a corporate man. Not even like a corporate girly, like I look like a corporate man. I'm on my way to Simo, passing through C-Town on a Z-Day. Um, I decided this summer, well now, today, this past couple of weeks I've been taking a different route to go to Kino Prussia and the reason being is because I want to reward my eyes by seeing nice things nice neighborhood nice everything so I am driving through a rich town and seeing all the houses that could potentially be mine in the future when I'm rich not rich when I'm comfortable for me because you guys know I don't want to be a millionaire. I just want to be comfortable for me. And I don't want, I don't ask for much. I don't want like a mansion. I don't want unlimited money. I want a farm with a greenhouse that I can sustain in the middle of winter. That's what I want if I stay in PA. And I want to be able to have a, wor a workable farm. You know, you know what I mean? Like a workable farm. That's my goal in life. My goal back in the days, when I was younger, my goal was to, and I think I'm gonna, I'm still going to accomplish that goal. I want to adopt a kid. And if I am financially well off, I want to open a orphanage. That's what I want. That's what I always wanted. And I have forgotten about those goals of mine until recently because you guys know that I'm in my head a lot and I only think about myself and I wonder and I was wondering like why like what were my what were my goals and I will tell people my goals all the time and then want I then I stopped because life got so crazy and chaotic that I completely stopped telling people my goals and and then, like, I just forgot about my goals. Bitch, I cannot believe I forgot about my goals. The goals that I set for myself. And I remember them. And I wanted to put it out there. What are my goals? And hopefully, I'll be able to accomplish them. I, will, I can work toward them, obviously. But that's, like, th those are the things that I want for my life. And that's what I want. So, that's 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 that. Um, tonight, uh, I, don't, I don't think I told you guys, but I miss Ashley's birthday bash because, because, um, when did I, okay, so I was at work that day and we were going to do an activity first and unfortunately I couldn't, I couldn't go to the activity, like I didn't, I didn't, um, do the activity. And the reason why I didn't do the activity was because um, I was working and I finished work at a, when the activity started. And then I had to go pick up my boyfriend. It was a lot. So I finished work 30 minutes, like literally when the activity started, like around 6.30. And I was supposed to meet them up, meet with them after the activity was finished. So maybe like around, maybe I like around nine something and by then i was like my boyfriend didn't want to go out because it was too late and we had to wake up super early in the morning and i was going to go out but then um i texted my cousin natasha which is ashley's sister and she's like you know what bitch everybody's lit like don't even come if you're having if you're good because i i was not i was not gonna drink at all because i had to drive and, I, and um, obviously Ashley wanted us to party with her so um, but before then or after then I don't remember we made this plans to go to I was I, I wanted to take her out to eat for her birthday and stuff so that's what we're doing right now not right now I'm sorry I'm going to work right now that's what we're doing after I finish work um, I'm gonna meet up with her in the city I gave her a list of restaurants that she could choose from and she shows the one that we're going well she chose two but I picked and then she made me pick oh my god that house 
There's so many man mansions around here. Love it. Um, but I, um, so we're, that's what we're doing tonight. Then, then, what was the other thing? I have one more thing to tell you. I forgot what I was going to tell you. But I'm going to work now. I haven't been working as much. Honestly, I'm not making money. Like, I'm literally so poor. Right now. I'm pretty rich right now. I'm so pretty rich right now. I don't know what is wrong with me and my pre-richness, but I'm too pre-rich. I'm like borderline pre-rich. Like I'm just pre-rich. And like I'm working on, oh my God, bamboos. I never seen bamboos here in Philly. Wow. I heard that they are very, um, like when you have bamboos, those type of bamboos, I heard that they are really hard to keep up because they can, they can be a lot. I don't really know. I don't, honestly, I don't know. But, um, I, oh my gosh, why can I speak right now? I'm so sorry. I don't know what's wrong with me. But that's what's happening. And tomorrow, it's going to be my day to off. And my boyfriend's obviously is going to be here tomorrow. Tomorrow is Sunday. I don't know what we're gonna do we want to go get massages like you know the two of us just get massages and we've been wanting to get massages for forever my boyfriend have never gotten a massage i got a massage once last year and i want to go get a massage so badly and i will i can go by myself and get a massage to be quite honest like it's not that i cannot go but i want my boyfriend i want we i want to go together with him and we said that we wanted to go together and it, there's no like what is the point of me going by myself and be selfish and enjoy by myself when i already made a promise to him that i will get it with him you know what i mean so that's what we're doing tomorrow we also have to do laundry because the <laughs> this past week i wanted to do laundry and i was going to do the laundry but i <laughs> okay so i was going to do the laundry and instead of um okay, okay, okay. so on the wednesday i think it was wednesday wednesday or tuesday i was gonna do the laundry i took the sheets the sheets out like I, I i was gonna do laundry but you guys it was so damn hot that i decided not to do them laundry and i texted him like babe like i want to do the laundry today but it's so hot I, all i want to do is be home and do absolutely nothing like it's too hot for me to like even move and he goes it's okay i just do laundry on the weekend so he's going to do laundry tomorrow he's gonna be home chilling all day today he deserves it he works super hard and you know i want him to enjoy his day like he doesn't get um i feel like for the past couple of weekends we've been doing just the most and it's great for him to to this weekend just to just to relax so he's just home right now i cooked for him yesterday and he still have food from yesterday so since he still has food from yesterday he's good you know like i don't have to worry about him not eating because again he has food from yesterday but i cooked and um we still have food in the house tomorrow we also have to go to costco because we ran out of toilet paper you guys I get you not if you I you guys know that I am like the person that I I love minimalist I don't do consumerism you guys know that I don't consume as much anymore I'm not a maximalist in consumption anymore I consume the bare minimum we went we got our Costco membership back in February that's when we got toilet paper in February it's fucking almost July and we just ran out of toilet paper and we gave half of our toilet paper not half like so the way that they sold it's like a bunch and then it's divided into one two three maybe like four or five things and we gave one of those things to his mom so the costco toilet papers will last you probably like over um it will last you over well, if you're a family of, let me see, we're only two people. 
So that means that we spend like what, 15, 20 bucks buying the whole thing of toilet paper. And when you buy toilet paper, I like, let's say Target or Walmart, the thing for 15 bucks every month, and it only lasts you like a month, and it basically lasts us forever. Like, I'm not even kidding. And obviously we, we pee, we take shits like every single day. So it's always there. Plus he travels. So I guess it's it, it's longer with me because with us because he travels and it's only essentially like me. But I don't know. It's just great that we, that we have that. And also the wipes last us this much. Like we probably won't have to like replace the wipes. Oh yeah, we do have to get more wipes. Um, but the wipes, the wipes also last forever. But unfortunately... I do use the wipes for a lot of different other things. Like I keep one in the car. Then I keep one on my, like I, I keep the wipes for a lot of different things. And then the paper towels, those are the huge, the paper towels. Um, paper towels are also like a huge thing that I'm so happy that, um, that we got and we still have some left. Like we haven't run out of paper towels and I use a lot of paper towels. Not in like a, not in a um, wasteful way, but I do use a lot of paper towels for different things for different purpose. So I do use a lot of paper towels, but I we do have like kitchen racks and things like that. So like I clean a lot with like paper towels and stuff like that. And but anything that I know that I can use like a reusable rack, like I can do that. So I think that's also like what has helped us not consume as much paper towel. Um, another thing, let me see what else we want to buy from them, from there. The next thing I'm going to buy, um, I don't know what else. I'm, I'm probably going to do a, an actual vlog and vlog and vlog with you guys. And whatever we buy that we buy in bulk, I'm going to, fr like, food-wise, I'm going to freeze. Like, obviously, you cannot freeze eggs. I mean, I think you can freeze eggs. I'm not sure. I can, like, Google if you can freeze eggs. But if I freeze eggs, bitch, like, our eggs is going to last forever, too. But I don't think I'm gonna buy them. I don't buy. I don't like to buy my eggs at Costco. I like to buy my eggs at a local place where I like the eggs is like locally. Um, it's like from a local place, and it's like pasteurized. Egg. Like I like pasteurized eggs. Like I don't. I don't know. Like I'm very weird about eggs because I consume. Well, we consume a lot of eggs, so we don't want to like. Ha like I don't know like I'm very weird with our, with our meats and stuff my boyfriend loved the Costco meats I don't really like the Costco meats to be honest like I do check every time the meat section of whenever like I go but I like I we only bought we bought it once and we still have eat at home frozen so we haven't had we haven't bought meat in a really really long time since I think March we haven't bought meat because we have consumed the meat that we have at home and I'm really good with like preparing meats like when he bought all of our meats I cut them and like slice them and because they give you like really thick cuts and I don't like the thick cuts so like I slice them and this time around like I didn't know that I was supposed to beat it to make it more tender because the meat like the last time that I cooked it for him he said that it was too hard I was used to eating it hard because I was like oh I think it's just me I don't know how to cook the meat but I guess it's because I have, you have to like tenderize it like by beating it. <sighs> I should go to Wawa and get a coffee, but I just passed it. You guys know that I don't do coffee. I don't know why I need a coffee right now. Like I don't want a coffee because it's not gonna do anything for me anyway. So I don't know why I'm like glam glamorizing getting a coffee. But I think it's nice and cute when you said, oh, I wanna go get a coffee. I think what I'm going to do actually I'm going to um oh that's what I that, that's what I forgot I think it's because I've been drinking so much matcha recently that I feel like I need to drink something I drink matcha like every day now I love matcha and I've started to drink um green not green tea but like herbal uncaffeinated tea um every night before bed Sometimes I do do my um, collagen tea. You know, they have a scus collagen tea that I love. Are these people dumb? Idiots. You're never supposed to go through there. This is why I hate some people. Some people are idiots. And you know what I hate? It's going to be very controversial. If... I were to do the same thing that they did 
I will get in trouble. You know what I mean? There's a very distinct, oh my God, it's gonna be hot as shit. Let me park over there. It's gonna be, ooh. It's gonna be hot AF, bitch. It's gonna be insanely hot today. Like me, I'm not even gonna like, you know how I, I park like the, um, you know, like the cool way to park. I'm not even gonna park like that because it's gonna be too hot and I don't want my car to get extremely hot. My car always get extremely hot and I, I'm only gonna be here for a couple of hours. I'm not gonna be here that long anyway. So, I don't know, I don't feel it. Anyway, that's it, bitch. Like, I don't even know what to say. Like, I don't even know what I talked about. I kind of blacked out. You guys know me. That's what I do. I blacked out when I talk to you. Um, I don't know. You see how I look? Like, I look like I'm dirty and, like, ew. Like, what the actual fuck? It's because I'm not recording with my camera. My camera is at home. I'm not recording with my camera because I don't even know what to tell you right now. Um, the new lip that we've been loving le lately. I will tell you that much, okay? Because you guys deserve to know. The new lip that we love right now, that I'm obsessed with, is the Westman Atelier Squeaky Clean Lip Balm. This is the color Mapoose. Literally, Mapoose. <laughs> it's gorgeous. I'm obsessed with it. Like, do you see that? Gorgeousness. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And makeup today, we're wearing the Kelly Ray. Um, well, they're getting my parking spot. I'm wearing the Kelly Ray tinted, tinted um, skin tint. The Westman Atelier blush um, in the color Carcone. Yes, I remember the color Carcone. Then we're wearing Kali Ray mascara. Um, then we're also wearing the Mario bronzer that you guys know that I love, the new one, the liquid one. Mixed with the um, Westman Atelier truffle, um, truffle thing or whatever. And then lastly, that's it. Oh, and the Morphe. I think I'm, I have the Morphe I, um, brow pencil. I've been using brow pencil recently. I don't know why I've been using the brow pencil. I think it looks more chic. And I love to look a little bit more chic. And I did. I cut. I washed my hair today. I was going to go to the hair salon. But I was like, I'm not going to go spend money on you bitches when it's this hot. I'm so sorry. But I don't want. I was going to sweat my hair out. And... I'm not gonna spend more money on my hair. I don't need anyone. Oh my god, and the air quality in Philly is so bad right now. You know what, bitch? I need to go. 